Morimoto Lighting has yet again changed the game when it comes to fog lights. There are two different fog lights that we're going to cover. It's their all new Morimoto XB Evo Plus. This is their elite version, and then there's also a Morimoto XB Evo. But are these any good? In this video, we're gonna show you guys the light outputs, and then we're gonna discuss the differences between the Evo Plus and the Evo. In just a second, I wanna show you guys what these look like on the wall, but first, what is the Evo Plus? What is the Evo? Simply put, the Evo Plus does both a white beam pattern, and then when you turn it off and turn it back on, it also can do a yellow beam pattern. So let's say it's raining outside or it's snowing outside, and instead of that white look, you wanna be able to see through the particles a little bit better with the yellow color. You can do that by simply turning it off and back on. Then your fog lights are going to be performing equally as good as the white version. There's not a lot of fog lights on the market that could do both white and yellow out of the same fog light and still produce a refined beam pattern. So I'm really excited to show you guys what this looks like, the XB Evo plus fog lights against the wall. The XB Evo is essentially the same. The beam pattern is the same, the width is the same, the brightness is the same. The only thing that's different is that you can't switch back into that yellow color, white to yellow. Both of these fog lights are gonna completely blow away your stock halogen fog lights if you had a halogen bulb in a housing. It doesn't even compare. That oftentimes is in a reflector housing and it just scatters the light and it doesn't really do anything useful. What you want to see when you're driving with your fog lights on is an extremely wide beam pattern and you want something with a small gradient of light. So when that light is closer to your vehicle, it doesn't blind you. It should be less bright the further it goes down. So how do these perform? I've got the table only about 15 feet away from the wall because I want you guys to see just how wide this beam pattern is. I use a digital lux meter to measure the actual usable brightness at a certain point on the wall. That's just so I can compare one fog light to another. Besides looking at that extremely wide beam pattern, look at the cutoff on the top. You are not scattering light all over the place. This is going to put the light exactly where you want it. I measured 370 maximum lux, so yes, it's really bright. Is it the brightest on the market? Probably not, but it was strategically designed to have an intensity like this. When you compare this to a reflector fog light housing, look at the difference. Now, that reflector fog light housing, in this case, is using a stock halogen bulb, and as you can see, it spreads the light everywhere. While doing this light output, I was actually blown away by how much scattered light there was on the top, the bottom, and the sides of the beam pattern of this fog light. No wonder fog lights don't really do much to help you. This is going to actually blind you when you're driving down the road. It's glaring on the road. That's all you're focusing on. You're not paying attention to where your eyesight should be, which is far out into the distance where your low beam and high beam hotspots are. Not to mention, the XB Fogs are 48% brighter than the stock halogens. Now, I just so happen to have some Ford F-150 stock LED fog lights, and they look like this. It's laughable when you compare it to the XB Fogs, and the stock LED wasn't even brighter than the halogen. It was actually only 200 maximum lux. So in this test alone, the XB Evos are 85% brighter than stock LED fog lights. But again, brightness isn't even the story when it comes to fog lights. You want a refined beam pattern that looks exactly like this, and you also want that extreme width that Morimoto has completely redesigned. With any light, I often see lower lux numbers with the yellow beam pattern, and it looks like this. I measured 210 maximum lux, but even in yellow, it's still brighter than the stock LED. So yes, that's less bright than the white version, but you still get that very refined beam pattern, which is super difficult to achieve. Any fog light that's on the market today does not have the exact same beam pattern as the white version. When it switches, it goes to a yellow beam pattern. Oftentimes it's throwing that light all over the place, kind of like that stock halogen reflector I was showing you. Morimoto has definitely stepped it up, and these are by far much better than the original fog lights they came out with years and years ago. Now these fog lights fit hundreds of vehicles, so the chances of them fitting your vehicle so you can upgrade your fog lights is very, very likely. There are three different types. As you can see, there's six boxes here. You got the XP Evo, XP Evo Plus, and then three different types. You've got the first type, which is right over here. This is type F2. Think 
F means Ford, so if you got a Ford, you're probably going to need this. And as you can see, it's totally different than these two. It is rectangular. It looks like this. And as you can see inside of this projector, you've got Osram Oslon chips inside. The quality of those LED chips are peak in performance. And that's why you get that light output that you just saw. The next type is this right here. You can see how it's kind of got a slant. This is the type T and this will fit Toyotas. Essentially all Toyotas you can think of. Type in your year, make and model at Headlight Revolution if you're curious if it's going to fit your vehicle or not. If you have a T, that means Toyota, get one of these. Now, the last type is a little bit more tricky and this is type S. This will fit a load of different vehicles out there. See how it's flat on the front? This will fit things like a Subaru WRX. So this right here covers pretty much any vehicle you can think of. If you want to upgrade your fog lights, go right ahead with the all new Morimoto XP fog lights. These fog lights are fitted with the latest in technology, compliance, quality, and styling. The fog lights are designed for enthusiasts who are serious about all of that. The XP Evo and Evo Plus fogs offer the industry's best combination of beam width and intensity and are fully compliant to the latest SAE J583F3 and ECE R19 regulations for on-road use in North America and in the EU. The Morimoto fog lights are expertly crafted to match all OE specifications to ensure perfect fitment and hassle-free install. They're designed as a direct replacement for the factory fog lights, not to mention the wiring is plug and play. On the back side of these fog lights, this is what the wiring looks like. Now don't be scared, this is super, super easy to overcome. As you can see here, it's two bare wires. It's not the connector. Now this connector that is plug and play to your factory connections is included in this box, so do not worry, you don't have to get anything. This is plug and play. The reason that the connector is actually D-pinned is so that way you can make sure that the polarity is correct when plugging into your vehicle. If you have a Toyota RAV4 or a 4Runner, the polarity might be different. So, in order to overcome that, what you're gonna do is first just test it. So you're gonna plug this into your OEM wiring. Once you figure out which way the polarity is supposed to be, then you can push the connector back in. It's super, super easy. I'll show you how to do it. Just make sure they sit in there all the way. Once you figure out the polarity, put these two in. It's as simple as that. Now this is plug and play to your vehicle. On all three of these types, there's also an integrated aiming adjuster that allows you to dial in the beam pattern height as well. If your vehicle is lowered or it's lifted and it's an off-road rig, you are gonna have to adjust these, but right out of the box, they should be aimed pretty well for your vehicle if it's at stock ride height. These fog lights are built to high standards and should easily last the life of your vehicle. On top of all of these features, there is my favorite part, which is a 10-year manufacturer's warranty, which means that if you ever have a failure, you can send these back in and get a full replacement. A 10-year out of a fog light warranty doesn't usually happen. From what I see, the standard is a maximum of five years, and the fact that these are a 10-year warranty actually blows my mind. This product is completely designed, engineered, and tested by Morimoto's team to meet the high expectations of their customers. Like I said before, they use high quality OE grade LEDs throughout. All wiring and connections are OE grade, and when it comes to UV protection, Toyota has the best in class protection. That's why they formulated a new hard coating that meets and exceeds Toyota standards for resistance against cracking, fading, and yellowing lenses from UV exposure. From what I can tell so far, just powering these up against the wall, they are extremely bright. But I do know that brightness is not all that matters. Width is super important, and this has got more width than I've seen out of any fog light that I've tested at Headlight Revolution. But how do these compare to the best competitors out there? We got about eight industry-leading fog lights that are getting shipped to us, so we can compare these XP Evos, see if these are the best fog light for you. Go to headlightrevolution.com, type in your year, make, and model if you're sold on what these look like and how they perform. And always check out our YouTube channel because we've got a lot of videos coming out for the all new XB Evo Plus and Evo fog lights.